Hey, so in this video, what we are going to do is handle the sorting through dragging each task. That's what we are going to handle using this plugin, uh, React Sortable HOC. I found this plugin to be quite simple and straightforward, and hence we will use this. So let's get into the code. In to do list, right? Basically, we need to first install these two packages. So, I'll go to my here. I'm running this server. So, npm install React Sortable HOC, and I'll need the array move npm module as well. The HOC component is obviously for the you know uh, reordering, and the array move is used when we finally get the new um you know position of each element and we will see how that will be working okay to do item index dot tsx um line number 19 okay let's fix that line number 19 it expects a double equal to so that is fine I'll do that and we should have a clean console in here okay i have the package installed as well let me restart the application a bit all right so yeah let's go into the list and first of all include those two packages from the document i will pick up those two things so import oops And I'll get this and I'll get this import array move as well. Okay. And one more thing which I know I will require is sortable handle. Okay. This is required so that my uh, drag and drop is only on this and not here because otherwise my click event will go away, right? So the drag and drop will happen only on this part so the first thing which we will do is create two components in here let's say constant sortable item equals sortable element i'll send certain props to that element so that we can you know, play around with it now uh, what basically we are doing is if you see the example right they have created a sortable item then a sortable list and then the sortable list is rendered and the sortable item is iterated inside the sortable list component right and that's exactly what we are going to do so we created this sortable item okay in that we will return certain markup which is our to do item now obviously we need certain props and that's why we have this so what we are doing is we are saying to do is props dot to do okay we need the mark as complete so mark complete should be this okay let's just copy that and then we also need to pass this you know drag handle so in the documentation i'll show you what that is going to do so if where is it yes if we use drag handle right using the uh, higher order component then only that element will be draggable now if we go inside our to do item we will see this is the element that we are talking about right so inside to do item this is our handle but this is inside the to do item right so how do we get that so what we do is we will play a small little trick okay um hmm. this is 
okay not right now not right now let's just say this is what we are going to pass okay and then we create one more component in here which is our list okay so constant sortable list this was the item this is the list it will be sortable container okay this is the second component which we have imported from here right where is the component right so sortable com container in here we pass items and mark complete okay items is basically you know the all the elements which are available uh, through the props we will send that across when we render it in our render function okay um, so in here we have return again and in this return we will have the ul to do list and in that we will do items dot map okay uh, i'll need the to do which is coming as items okay so to do and index um yeah this is where the bracket will be okay and so now this list will use this sortable item so what all things do we need to pass it we need the key okay which will be our index that is fine we have done that index is a property which we anyways need to send it if we go to the documentation um this is container container right so if you see access and all are fine but in the item which is below here somewhere i have seen it right the index is a required field right so we pass the index and we pass the key key is anyways important because you know that's how react uh, works so the to do is passed this sortable item right it is expecting um, certain props so i'm passing to do and if you see what i am doing here is props dot to do so anything apart from key and index are you know props dot and then they are available so to do i have sent and then mark to do complete which will be this again you know how i'll send it through the list component and then see i do need to send the drag component somehow okay so i'll just copy this i'll create a component inside the container constant uh, let's say drag handler equals sortable handle so one more stateless component and we will return this right nothing nothing uh, fancy just uh, this component and what we will do is we will pass the sortable item this drag handle as a component let's just take this thing like this okay and so the alignment is correct and now in here obviously i'll have drag handle which will be prop start drag handle however this property is not something which the to do item is expecting right so first we need to change our interface oops um sorry what is the key drag handle and then i'll just remove this and if you remember how we um, had our 
you know, card component refactor so we will render this okay so what we are saying is the to do item it expects the to do as a prop we are sending it it expects mark to complete function we are sending it and we are sending one more component to the to do item which is the drag handle component okay and so with those things ready i think render function is not required anymore because we will render something of our own okay so when we go into the render function what we do is sort table not handle but list right sortable list is what we are going to uh, kind of use okay i will have items that is a required parameter which is this dot state or rather to do's okay then on sort end is a required function this is where we will get so if you see on sort end right on sort end where is the documentation it provides us these keys so why don't we copy them sorry um ta -ta 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 -ta. all right i know that we will not need those keys we will only need these so we'll do this the alignment is completely uh going for a toss sortable list what what is it saying okay right uh, I need to send the mark to do complete as well because the sortable list right expects that so items we have provided right and mark to do complete is going to be to do this dot mark complete this is basically the prop which is being sent to the list component first from the the main component right and the list is then passing it to the sortable item which is internally passing it to the uh, to do item so basically what we need to understand is that what we have done is created certain higher order components which doesn't have an ui but they have certain um, and you say functionalities in that component hence the to do component is wrapped inside the sortable item to get that functionality in place and we have a container sortable list which repeats the entire thing so the entire ul is basically inside that okay by the way i could have uh, done this as in separate component but i wanted this inside and hence i have done it like this we can even mark them as a separate component if you like but yeah it's completely up to your choice so we have these two components inside our main component right sort item sort list we are rendering it in here um, the sort end right we will handle it in some time but let's first look at the items items we have entered then we have sort thing we need to say that use handle is true so that the sortable list understands that the entire component is not draggable it's only the drag drag handler which will need to be dragged and we will add a helper class okay helper class is equal to dragging item okay now if everything is correct i think no it is not it is failing somewhere to do list line 30 what is the problem expected an assignment or function call instead saw so raw expression okay uh, why is this happening Mm. sortable item this is fine 
drag handle mark complete seems to be fine i don't understand what is the problem so key index this is here mark to do is coming through this okay expected an assignment or function call an instant saw an expression hmm let me quickly check all right so i had a syntax problem which is you know which was creating the issue so i had to recheck everything and then i got it to working okay so yeah uh, so as a quick recap why don't we i know it's it's a little confusing so i'm trying to you know make you understand it again and uh, just hold on so we are you know importing two higher order uh, actually three hocs okay the first one is sortable item which is a sortable element we are declaring this as an element the individual item which will be dragged okay that we have wrapped with the to do item okay so this is complete oops sorry what have i done hmm. so yeah we'll minimize it the next is sortable list okay sortable list is the container and hence the stable uh, sortable container name it is the container which uh, holds all the uh, sortable items or the sortable elements okay and so this is where we are iterating and we created one component here which is our drag component this was required so that as we said we only want the dragging to be available on this which was inside our to do element so we had to remove it from this markup pass it as a prop inside the to do element and then render it okay i can send any component in here i can uh, do something like maybe inside the span I have okay like this and it will use it so this is now my handle but yeah we had the design so we will use that now refresh now you will see there is a small problem first of all this I will remove for some time because I am not very sure with the CSS why that thing is you know going in the next line however this drag thing right we can uh, fix so if you remember i had added a helper class let's come over here i have added a helper class dragging item right this is the li which is created when the drag happens so in my global.css what i will do is uh, in here list style is none I'll do that doesn't refresh right okay and now you can see this is working that you know the dot thing is gone and my dragging is you know in place however there's one more part which we haven't done yet which is let's say I take the first one put it at the last okay and it resets back to the original state why because my state is not getting modified the list is changing on the fly but the moment i release it my state i mean this list is you know back to the state which it was and based on that we haven't changed the index so that's why it is not working that is what we are going to handle in our next video